Hi everyone. So I'm Chitra CJ taking you ground improvement techniques. So let's see the free strain and equal strain condition of sand drain and also the design of sand drain layouts. <music> basic theory of vertical drain is presented for two fundamental cases first is free strain condition in which we are the surcharge that is applied over this ground is flexible in nature and it causes an uneven settlement of this ground over the surface in the figure you can see that the load that is coming over the ground is equal in nature but it is having an uneven settlement in the next condition that is equal strain condition the surcharge that we are applying is rigid in nature and the surface settlement will be the same all over however this will result in an unequal distribution of stress next is layout of sand drains the drains are generally laid either in square pattern or triangular pattern and the spacing of the drain that is s is smaller than that of the thickness of the embankment 2H in order to reduce the length of radial drainage path. Here in the figure you can see a vertical drain and over that we are providing a sand blanket and above it we are providing a surcharge for consolidation. The typical design parameter of the sand drains may be as follows. The spacing of the sand drains S is about 2 to 5 meters. And the depth of the sand drains ranges from 3 to 35 meters, denoted as 2H. Radius of sand drains will be RW and it is 0.2 to 0.3 meter. Thickness of the sand blanket is 0.6 to 1 meter. The figure shows uh, the plan view of a triangular spacing. Here the Drains are F and the influence on is capital D of diameter and the drain is of diameter small d and the spacing between the two drains are capital L. In this figure we can see that if R is the radius, if R is the radius of this influence then S is the spacing then this a relation R is equal to 0.525 of S and 2H is the depth of the strain. 